Hello everybody, my name is Yurio, and welcome back to another video on my Let's Play World. Now, it has been a while since I've uh, touched this world in the first place, so I have decided that I wanted to start doing a couple other things. First of all, um, I am not happy with this uh, pathway right here at all. So I think what I'm going to have to do first is get a lot of cobblestone and some stone and some maybe some deep slate to make some nice better pathway and more rugged pathway instead of just it being a path like this because it's way too uneven and this is such an uneven surface to the point where it like I just have to jump up normally like from here yeah th this is not comfortable so um well this is a very quick intro. I'm not used to this. But what I'm probably going to be doing is mining this out. And then I'm going to probably carve this area out a little bit. And yeah, I'm going to start doing a little time lapse. Right. Really? Time lapse? <laughs> it, it really doesn't seem like something I would really do at the immediate start of the video. But apparently that's what I feel like doing. So yeah. Here we go. This is way better, even though the texture of the birch right there is way different. Now, I'm not exactly sure. This birch and uh, bamboo does not go too well together. Now, I was a bit lazy with this, and I did not even mine a single bit of stone. Now, I mined all this dirt, thinking that I had to terraform just a little bit. I had to terraform a little bit right here. And um, that's it over there. So um, so you can see that I put some lanterns here. I mean, bamboo, I think, is a great block right there. It's, it's a great block, but I think it, I want to keep the bamboo. But I, I really do not agree with, uh, with this a birch and this that's the thing about this um it's way better uh it, it's just better in general so yeah oh i haven't shown you guys that i actually decided to add one extra mod that will let the night go by but the tick speed goes faster and all the sky changes as you see the stars in the window maybe depending on your device and yeah, um, custom message on the bottom, and yeah, um, way better, and whenever you wake up, it actually wakes up at the sunrise, so it act, I, I'm not sure about the phantom deal though, so I might need to handle that at some point, point. and one thing I really like about this view now is that whenever you look out, you could just see everything, like, you could just see entire world all the way there with the distance horizon mod it is a real nice mod to have because if you just look out you can see all your projects and this is i think where i'm going to have like all my pro like all my projects like like maybe i'll have an atomic bomb over here or a like some sort of nice terraforming over here that makes it look nice and everything at some point but you may have also seen that I've mined all that dirt there. Now, it's the four chunks that are supposed to be removed at some point. I'm not sure at what point, but I thought, oh, I'm just going to get some dirt. And apparently it took way longer than I thought with a iron shovel. How many? I went through so much iron. I went through 12 iron ingots with shovels to get through all of this dirt right here. Now... 
I am very concerned on how I'm going to, at some point, put a beacon in because um, I, I need to put a, well, that's this is like future purposes. Yeah, I'm not too much of a fan of that. Oh, I need to fix that at some point. But um, I'm not too much of a fan of that, but I want the view to be um, probably a whole border of obsidian kind of like last version of my let's play because I think that's how it should be but uh, for here it would be a cobblestone of a uh, uh, corner probably not cobblestone sorry obsidian edge and on flat surface like last and then I'm going to have three blocks of cobblestone here as the paths I think I'm going to dedicate cobblestone as the paths for now until there's way better path blocks but there's going to be obsidian here this is going to be the y level right here so i it's pretty much universally agreed except for this thing right here and this over here but i mean i could easily modify that terrain right there so i've been looking at this other area not like i, I saw this on episode one two or even three i think it's i think it's episode one i saw where, where I saw this now. Oh, hello there. <laughs> That's funny. Um, I saw this little area down here, and I thought, well, this is very good area to terraform. Now, there's a couple things here. There's a skeleton there and some floating gravel. Now, this area does look like a great area to terraform so if i were to flatten this area out down there and light this area up and then put a campfire there and just somehow have the ability to just get it all terraformed nicely i think it would look brilliant and look nice and remove some of these trees here and somehow at some point make a maybe not a cobblestone path or maybe a cobblestone transition into a um dirt path and path dirt path block now, should I do this? I mean, should I? I'm still thinking. Now, I you think, oh, I should be thinking about this way earlier. But no, I have not thought about this. No, why not? What is there to lose? I mean, it's just going to be a fun project. I mean, it, it, I do love terraforming. It's one of my most favorite things to do in Minecraft. So I think what I might have to do at some point in the next little bit is to start mining actual stone and maybe try and get a couple diamonds so I could not be reliant off iron the entire time. And then I'm going to remove some of these trees and then start terraforming all of this area, I think. I think it would look awesome, like have a campfire down there and just have it look very nice. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to be doing. So yeah. Um, oh, wait, I, I need to change my skin. After this time ups, I'll have my better skin and I bet it will look very, very, very nice. I really hope. So yeah, I'll see you guys after this time lapse. <laughs> Well, I'm back. <laughs> now, I got this very, very, very nice area uh, terraformed. And holy smokes, it looks way better now. I am real super surprised on how good this area looks without any of the trees, like no mobs are spawning. It just looks pretty nice. I also added a waterfall here. So, in a little pond here, just because... It, it just needed a tad bit of something else. I knew something was missing, and that was the thing I think it was missing. 
now I need to figure out what else I should do with this area. Maybe I could finish up terraforming this area, and maybe not this episode, but maybe on a stream and just terraform it to how I like it. And then over here, it it's the temporary area where I jump off so I don't have to just worry about taking damage every single time I go down. But I think at some point I'm going to need to, um, what is it called again? Add some sort of path from this side down here. So maybe I'll have a three block wide path, mine this out, and then right here I'll have a ladder, which I think should be what it should be right there. So yeah, um, now I'm a bit scarce on food, even though, yeah, I'm a bit scarce on food, only 15, um, 15 bread and eight apples. So I need to go somewhere, anywhere around here, to go and find a cow and pick them up because also a wandering trader came by at some point, wherever the lead is. <laughs> but um, yeah, uh, yeah, there's a lead. A wandering trader came by, so yeah. Um, I think what I. I'm going to probably head that direction first because I think that direction is going to be a real fun direction to go. Even I've been that direction once and also we get to go and look at this again and it does look nice. Yeah, so. Wow, yeah. Man, I wonder what I could do with all this terrain here. Okay, I have found two cows. So I think what I'm going to be doing first is just lead them up and then head all the way back to my place. So now I have the cows that I need and somehow I lost the lead, two leads apparently. So I wonder where I should put these cows. I think I should put them kind of close to the wheat farm down here. Now I am, this may not be a permanent spot for that, that because it will prevent them from spawning so man these cows are very complicated and yeah so I just brought up these cows and yeah it is now we have actual food ready for me I guess man I bet if I were to go any other direction it would have took me twice as long don't know why they didn't spawn until now. What biome is this? A savanna. Okay, just double checking. But yeah, now I just have to breed them up. And yeah, so this should be it for this video. I still forgot to change my skin, but this should be it for the video. I hope you guys liked it, and I'll see you guys in the next video of my Let's Play or the UE server. So yeah, see ya.